Hey everyone, Fetic Ivy here, and recently I got addicted to this game called Project Playtime. I've never been a fan this game spins off from, called Poppy Playtime. If anything, I dislike the game. But I had heard this was a fun multiplayer game. What I found was an amazing multiplayer experience that I just can't stop playing. So I'm here to explain to you why I enjoy this game so much. I'll start with the first thing people will learn about the game when you play, that being the gameplay loop. You either play as a survivor trying to solve puzzles that will give you the parts to build a toy, and then once it's built you can escape. Or you play as the monster and you try to kill all the survivors and stop them from building the toy. Okay, yes, yeah, so it's not the most original basis for a game, but we will talk about that in a second. For now, I just want to say that this is a fun and addictive gameplay loop that really makes you go, alright, just one more game, and then be on for another hour. Now, about the originality point I was talking about earlier. The thing that sets this game apart from other games in its field is its community. In most other games like this, the player base is super sweaty and makes it really hard to just sit down and play casually. Since all the sweats are on the other, more mature games, Project Playtime is left with a really chilled out and casual player base, and I really like that about it. Now, another really good part of this game is how it handles horror. It's no secret that most people don't really like horror games and even the more seasoned players tend to not do very long sessions and that's completely fine. Everyone has their tolerance for horror and it just eventually has a limit. Project Playtime is able to combat this by simply not focusing the game on horror. Yes, you will every now and then get caught off guard by a jump scare or scream a little when the monster comes around the corner and you weren't expecting it. But most of the time it's a fairly horror-free experience with a little tension. This allows for the best of both worlds. A little bit of horror to keep you guessing, but you don't get too worn out so you keep coming back. So, have I grabbed your interest in this game with my video? Well, good news. This game is completely free to play. So, you can get a few friends around and have a grand old time. I will warn you though, this game is currently in early access. So you may experience a few but frequent bugs. But most of them aren't game breaking and normally just a bit silly. Hey, hope you liked the video. If you did, then please subscribe. It's free and helps small creators like me so, so much. On that note, I've been Fetikaivi, and I bid you farewell.